Bellator MMA live on Spike tonight from Boyd Gaming's Kansas Star Casino. Let's get right to it with a fight featuring two of Bellator's best lightweights, Dave Jansen taking on Rick Hahn. Dave Jansen apparently watched the Douglas Lima fight. Leg kicks from beginning to end in this fight, both inside and outside. Dave Jansen, the aggressor with his striking. The layoff he had, he said, I improved my kickbox, and it showed tonight as Rick Hahn had no answer for his attack, a unanimous decision win. On then to the women's featherweight division, Annalisa Bucci taking on Marluz Kunin. Marluz Kunin aggressive at the start of this fight. Easy takedown against Annalisa Bucci. Working her takedown, her ground and pound. Annalisa Bucci on defense, on the ground, even when she was on top, doing everything she could to stay in this fight, but never found her own offensive rhythm at the beginning of round number three. An awkward position with Marlouz Kunin, able to the arm underneath the neck for the choke tap out in the start of round three. To the heavyweights we go, two big, powerful heavyweights, undefeated Carl Etherington taking on Bobby Lashley. With guys this big, it only takes one mistake, and it was Carl Etherington making that mistake, slipping on the throw, and Bobby Lashley just teeing off with right hands. Carl Etherington having nowhere to go. He taps due to strikes with the left hand here, and that is all she wrote. And finally tonight, our main event, the fight for Bellator's light heavyweight world title, Linton Vassell versus the champion, Emmanuel Duke. Linton Vassell thought he had superiority on the ground with his submission game, and he showed that in the first two rounds all over the champ, Emmanuel Newton. There were several times that it looked like the champ was gonna tap and lose the belt on the ground. Beautiful job transitioning, taking the back. Great sweep from the bottom, almost finishing it here with this Kimura straight arm combination. But in the championship rounds, it was the champ, Emmanuel Newton, asserting himself after round two, Litton Vassell not able to get this rear naked choke, and Emmanuel Newton returning to his feet later on in the fight, finding his range, getting his takedown going, his ground and pound wearing down Linton Vassell until early in round number five. The sprawl, you'll we'll see here, he turns and takes the back, and without even getting hooks in, he gets the rear naked choke finish, a power submission win for the champ, Emmanuel Newton. Second successful title defense for Emmanuel Newton. For the latest Bellator news and information, it's Bellator.com. When a man questions your integrity, he's the most selfish sack of crap you've ever met. Belittles your family and fans. Poor Jenna, I don't know how she put up with you all those years. The payback will be brutal. Spike presents Bellator MMA, Tito Ortiz versus the American psycho Stefan Bonner. Plus Chandler versus Brooks 2, Saturday, November 15th.